Peter was captured by Herod and put in prison. As they were praying for Peter to be released. And when God answered the prayer, they couldn't believe it. So it means they were praying, not expecting. They were just praying religiously. They were praying according to what they were taught. Not with full assurance. There's what I call insecurity prayer. And that's what we're going to avoid tonight. That as we are praying, we don't believe it's going to happen. Hallelujah. We're just praying because we have been taught to pray. And we are doing it religiously because we are taught. But I want you to believe. The Bible says, even when Peter knocked at the door, and they said, this man sounded like Peter, but probably is his angel. This could not be Peter. Because we know who Herod is. Hallelujah. We know that when he captures you, you're not going free. Glory to God. But we're just praying. Tonight, God is telling you that as you are praying, believe it. Hallelujah. Because the word has been given to you. The intentions of God is for man to prosper. Not physically only, but even spiritually. There are spiritual prosperity and physical prosperity. Both of them has to be combined together. Amen. You cannot only be having a vision where you are living in a very big, mighty house. And whenever you wake up, you are still in somebody's house. Hallelujah. You cannot only be dreaming that you are having that big job. is in a dream. You see yourself, God revealed to you. But every time you wake up, you are still in the same job where you are fighting with everybody. From the manager to the newest person on board. Hallelujah. This is not the intentions of God. He said, I wish above all things that you prosper. Even as your soul prosper it. Glory to God. And that's why the first time God created man, he put him in a place where he will have everything surrounded to him. So the only thing that fights prosperity is death and poverty. And God is going to banish it today. What the enemy uses to keep man close to himself is Pain. Pain. And we're going to be praying against every pain, no matter the kind of pain, whether it is physical, whether it is spiritual, whether it is emotional. God is going to take it out today in the name of Jesus. We're going to pray as men that have been taught by God to pray and also taught by God to believe and also see that God when he speaks, he will bring it to pass in the name of Jesus Christ. Now lift up your hands wherever you are and begin to worship the king of glory. Begin to worship him. Begin to say to God, I believe and I know that he will bring it to pass. I believe and I know that he will bring it to pass. No man has the ability, but you are our Father. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Our Father, Father means the foundation. You are our foundation. Glory to God. You are our source. We proceed from you. 
The scripture said that man that is born of a woman is with a few days and full of trouble. But we have transcended. We have moved on from being born of a woman. We are no longer born of a woman. And that's why we remain a mystery to the world and to the demons, to every powers of darkness, to every powers of hell. We remain a mystery. Because everything that happens to a man born of a woman cannot progress with us, cannot affect us, cannot affect your family. But we are born of God. And it says, any man that is born of God overcometh the world. Any man born of God. Hallelujah. Lift up your voices. Begin to command. Yes, that you must maintain your status this day. In the name of Jesus. Maso robo kosekeba. Gentema en palukaba. Ribo bobo bobo bobo. Manse kelebo sakia. Zende leba on toko bo sa. Ripra gobo sakimbo sakia. Zelebo boski. Mante lebobos. Ma inkoviatobo sapaligada. Rima bankei baskondo ribobos. Ye shall liban to kia. Mari gakos. Ebdanimo senkai. Yes, Lord. Reba babobos. Ma king babos singremotai. Leso bian fenobos. In the book of Jeremiah. Chapter 29, verse 11. We're going to read it and we're going to pray. The Bible says, For I know the plan I have for you, declares the Lord. Plan to prosper you and not to harm you. Plans to give you hope and the future. Every spirit whose job is to attack your hope. I want you to pray this moment. That every attack on your hope will be totally destroyed tonight. Open your mouth. Any attack on my hope, any demonic powers, any powers of darkness, any powers in the high places that is sent to attack my hope and my future, Agano, Weredia Kobos, and Teli Zadi Barunata, Rally Vevu take the balls I want you to open your mouth, decree tonight, and declare that every power attacking my hope and my future, I release a fire against you tonight. I release the power of God to demolish every foundation of this demonic presence, every foundation of these high places, every demonic powers that is using these powers of darkness to destroy my hope and my future. I garments on the negasia look the bang at us has called it sectimono webali kakos or sazitika robeli can kubo a gemianko or veli vivionta manga to rob or score masaka. Lika onto kika, rabe ka susi tai, jami lambros, a zegi vanuta. Open your mouth, decree and declare. My hope and my future can no longer be attacked by the enemy. In the name of Jesus Christ, whatever level, whatever hierarchy that has been sent to oppose and stop my hope, to oppose. And stop my future. I release the fire. 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 Mankebo Senegi. Ye Kabado Rubos. Magli Darubos. 
Ratemba Shikabos. On Venetemusa. Rebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebebeb
you shall no more be in existence in the name of Jesus Christ. Because the Lord is changing me, the Lord is changing my broken hearted, is changing my crushed spirit. God is the one encouraging me tonight. God is the one that is rearranging what the enemy think that he has spoiled. Yes, yes, open your mouth, decree it, declare it. Yes, because I am no longer born of a woman. Therefore, the plan of God must be fulfilled in my life. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, decree and declare it. He said, I overcome the world. Hey, Kabbalah. Rabba de Kebo. Ropre Gedebus. Yendelebobos. Bashila Bokata. Venu Brekebus. Onte Likabasai. Reba Bekonto Velaba. Je Preketelekebus. Rebe Bebebebebebebe. Ripangalabos. Sekebo. Ripraganelos. Riba Kin Fenos. Lopre Gebadusi. Jeman Padukabasa. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Do not think that you will not have children. <laughs> Glory to God. You know, God, God just reminded me something. I met a woman who was 45 years or there about, about 45 or more. Glory to God. And she was going to marry a man who is 30 years. I mean, he gave the man 15 years. And there was, you know, hell broke loose. The man's family says that this man will never. In fact, this lady must have used something to capture this man. So everybody was angry. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I never knew that was what going on. But as, as I had a prayer meeting, the lady entered. And the Lord said to me, turn around, tell her that that which God has written can never be deleted. I said, the plan of God is that you marry that man. Glory to God. And finally, because the family was saying, he will never, how can it be? Because this woman, we don't think he will never have a baby. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I want to tell you today, they have six. In fact, the same people turn around and began to say, they are having too much baby. I want you to pray. I want you to pray. They later got married. There was fight. But at the end of the day, the people who thought that their plan will, pro, will pro, proceed and overpower the plan of God, they never get through. This lady has six, in fact, people started complaining that they are having too much baby. How are they going to train them? I want you to pray. God is saying to you tonight that every pain, according to how much pain, that you have gone through, he said, I'm going to multiply that prosperity in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, decree and declare it, and say to God, heal me and bind my wounds in the name of Jesus Christ. Heal me according to Psalms chapter 147 verse 3. He said, heal me and bind up my wounds. Every wounds that the enemy has inflicted in my life, every wounds that he have enjoyed in the years past, every wound that they have enjoyed this season, seeing me in pain, seeing me wounded, this day the Lord is healing me in the name of Jesus Christ. Heal me and bind my wounds, oh Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Ma ferrabos. Raka batilabo. Ripon cobos. Ripon cobos. Ripon cobos. Ripon cobos. Ashamuribo confellabo. Rapre keto cobaha. Rapa hika tohobo. Rapa kute hika bahaya. Rabba hiko solukidia. Zambre nikondia. A veli brenons. A zeto velebo kosa. A jeki katuluko paya. Rapa kito koteleke. Rima gompolo. A satu 
Ke fo ziporo kontai jamali kabarosa impato no gabo hari pantu amelanga hari gembe tolabo on sekute on tenabo in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Heal me, Lord. Heal my broken heart. Buy my wounds. In the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. In the book of Revelation, chapter 21, and verse 4, the Bible says, He will wipe every tear from your eyes. And there will be no more debt or mourning or crying or pain. For the old order of things have passed away. Whatever old order that has been generated in your family and is running through, it's like a technology that is running through, you know, tested and approved. They say in your family, People get blind at a certain stage. In your family, people get crazy or get mad at a certain stage. Even when everybody avoided everything that will bring madness. Everybody, you see, everybody will line up and say, you know what? We will not touch any madness. We will not touch anything that bring madness. We will not drink. We will not smoke ganja. We will not put anything that... We will not test drugs. Yet, because that technology has run through generations, after a while, you will see a madman in your family. They might not be wearing tattered clothes, but the life will show you that this person has something that is missing. Be acting crazy. I want you to pray that that technology will be destroyed. <laughs> Hallelujah. That the old order will be destroyed tonight. I don't care. Whatever it is, it might be something that is going on in your family that people, people will never unite together. No matter how many people try, something must happen that everybody will scatter. So no one to Help one another. No one to help to pull up one another. Sometimes it's disease. Sometimes it's emotional wreck. Sometimes problem. People will go to college, but they will never graduate. It is running. Tested and approved. Sometimes People will go to the highest level of education, but they will never make it or prosper in life. In fact, they won't be able to even have good life. Glory to God. You see people with PhD, children will be slapping them. Slapping them, or you might end up in a place, a place of work, because it has to work. Where people are slapping, people's hands are moving unexpectedly. Like malfunctioning. But it's going to be reaching your cheeks anytime. So you'll be hiding. You will learn to defend yourself from slapping and slap. And it will be a technology that I've run through. No matter how high you go, you're going to stay low. I want you to pray. We're going to break every old order in the name of Jesus Christ. There is a new order this night that God says, I am stating, I am stating, he said, I am stating a new order in your family. New order, new technology in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth and decree every old order that is working against me, that is working against my children, that is working against my family from top to the last. I release fire. Makabo robote. Yes, let the bulldozer of heaven begin to locate every technology 
tested and approved, he is going to be crushed today. Every old order will crush you, we destroy you, we crush you, we destroy you, we crush you, we destroy you. Yes, oh Paracude, Vento Paradula, Rapa Contokabo, Rapa Contekabo, Reba The more you go higher, the more discouraged you are. This day, that old order is being destroyed in the name of Jesus. Oh, ye poor Kepori, Rabo, Sekibo, Yendelobo, Sakibo, Oscar Brenegado, Sakibo, Oshe Patiki Tilikato, Rabo de Kikabo, Senebos. No matter how you want to make peace, trouble is pursuing you. It's like a waiting. They wait for you wherever you go. Even if you go to China, they are staying there waiting for you. You run away far from home. Someone will make himself available for the trouble. So you can't get away. Old order. I want you to pray. That old order must stop tonight. You work so hard, but you eat so little. People could see the sweat. They will see all the veins running out of your neck, running out of your head. They will look and bear witness that you work so hard. But the more you work, the less you see. I want you to break it tonight. Every old order. A capo in a kodo. Raki de infetula. Zampeli katoya. A shile potika. In pramons. O sandi benuka. Raka dunikaya. Jakatalabo. Rabaka tekido. Rabaka telako. Rabaka telako. Jampre kotolabo. Zipato komplenaya. Rabande kakolesianto. In the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth. Somebody will not exchange you for himself, for herself. Hallelujah. Oh, I know what I'm talking about. People exchange. Yes, they use the same technology and they can exchange to those who are sleeping. He said, when men slept, when men slept, the enemy is so tired. You have not asked your question. You have not asked an intelligent question. Spiritual intelligent question, and God will answer you. Glory to God. You have not asked, Why am I in this position? What is going on? And they will run the technology and show you how it started. Somebody paid for it, somebody bought it. And when this person bought it, it is tested and approved, and it was handed over. But unfortunately, it was demonic technology and set you up on edge. So now you are working so hard, but the more you work, the less you see. It's like the more you look, your eyes are open, but you are seeing less. This night is going to be broken. Old order. Open your mouth. Whatever old order you can remember, open your mouth and decree and say, every old order, every old order must pass away today. Must, must, must pass away. Passing away means death. It will no longer be remembered. It will no longer happen to me. It will not even follow my children. Not my address. My address will be deleted in their memory. In the name of Jesus Christ. And their machineries will be destroyed. In Kaboro, Dekika, Rapande Kerabo, Rapregetolobo, Repa Ekabo Sentaya, Zambrege de Lemosa, Jekema Impra Kotolo, Rapoki Vento Brenegedos, Ropo Gutwama Kindalaba, Zante Ketelekete, Repreketelekete, Lepreketelekete, 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 Zampareko Botako. Kabu kohoba kahaya, di marambo kosiya motala. In the name of Jesus Christ, glory to God, glory to God. Yes, the Bible said in Matthew chapter four. From verse 23, the Bible said, Jesus went throughout Galilee, 
teaching in the synagogue, proclaiming the good news of the kingdom, and healing every disease and sicknesses among the people. News about him spread all over Syria, and people brought to him all who were ill with various diseases. Those suffering severe pain, demon possessed, having seizure, and paralyzed, and he healed them. Whatever category you find yourself right now, suffering, glory to God, you can be a witness that you're suffering. Good news for you. Good news for you. You can see that suffering is, is not pleasant. Suffering is pain. Painful. And that's why Jesus had to step in to heal. Healing means it takes them away. It, it takes them away. Taking it away. Taking it away. He's not trying to manage, you know. What people do is to manage pain. They will tell you how to manage it. So you take two tablets in the day, three in the evening, seven in the night. And any time the tablets start going, going scanty or, or finishing, you start panicking. Because you know what pain is like. You don't want it. So you manage it, but Jesus takes it away. I want you to pray this moment. God, take my suffering away. I want you to pray that prayer. Don't keep quiet. Take my suffering away. Take it away, O oh Lord. Take my suffering away. In the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth. Decree and declare it. Open your mouth. Say, Lord, take my suffering away. Take my suffering away. Take my suffering away, Lord. Take it away in the name of Jesus. Take it away. Take it away. Take my suffering away. Yes, Lord. Take it away. Yes. Yes, Lord. 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 Yes, Rakeba in pronovos. Take my suffering away. Take it away. Heal it, Ma. Heal it, my God. Heal it. Heal me from this suffering. Open your mouth. Heal me from this suffering. Heal me, Lord. Take them away. Take them away, Lord. Take them away. Just like you did in Galilee. Take it away. In the name of Jesus Christ, take away this suffering. Anga porimo sandoriba, jekema apolo bosei, zambre divato bosaka, zaperi kongobo salimalos, ripra katelobos. Yes, take it away, take it away, Lord. In the name of Jesus, take it away. In Jesus' name, I want you also to pray against every severe pain. I want you to pray against every severe pain. Say, Lord, Lord I pray this moment. I pray this morning. And I decree Amen. that every severe pain, severe pain can no longer reside with me. No yes, it can no longer be with me. Take it away, Lord. Dissolve it tonight. Heal me from every severe pain. There are two persons under the sound of my voice tonight. You need to raise your voice. Hallelujah. That pain crushing your bone. That pain going through your body. That pain that has mastered your body and ruling your body. The Lord said, I am destroying it tonight. I'm taking it away. In the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth. Say this severe pain. Leave my body. Leave my body. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, Lord. They brought fearables in petrol of a sick. They called them a terrible son. Come on now. Brought in Pelago Soteva Casa. Zipra non como Satelica Toya. Yes, Lord. A petomas etaculables. 
Rabendia Kelebos, Yefe to Mangibo, Secundelia. Yes, Lord, take away this severe pain. Take it away, Lord. Take it away. Take it away. Take it away. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We're going to pray against every paralysis. Paralysis. There's somebody under the sound of our voice tonight. The enemy wants to paralyze you. Paralyze, meaning that he wants you to start moving with wheelchair permanently. But as I pray tonight, God is going to strengthen your bone. You're going to stand like a soldier of the Lord. You're going to walk away from that pain. In the name of Jesus. And the sound of my voice. Yes. The Lord is going to touch you. As you're hearing my voice tonight. You are not going to be paralyzed. Yes. Yes Lord. Yes Lord. Yes Lord. Yes Lord. Yes Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Glory to God. 
It was huge diamond. He took it and he was telling those two men, I have given it to him. They were not listening. They were not talking. They were still pursuing him. Because he was a thief. I was even moved. This thing I'm telling you happened within five minutes. In fact, when I, when I got up, I looked at the time. It was just less than five minutes. But this is what took place in the spirit. I didn't know I have a diamond. But it was handed over to me. And when I was talking to this man, I said, I know him. He's not a thief. They were not listening to me neither. They continue pursuing him. I want you to know, whatever that belongs to you, that demon has possessed, this night, you got to stand up. Even the ones you don't know, they must return it. Yes, In the Lord. name of Jesus Christ, Lord. the ones you have not seen, yes, the Lord. ones you didn't know, they will return it. Yes, sir. Yes, they will Lord. dispossess it tonight. They will say, it doesn't belong to me. Take it. The fire will be so much that they will return whatever they have stolen. In the name of Jesus Christ, open your mouth. Decree, declare it, decree, declare it, decree, declare it. Everything that belongs to me, everything that the demon has possessed, I command you to return it. 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 switch. When I mean switch, it said the kings walking on barefoot and the servants riding on horses. People walking hard. They eat like ants. And those walking like ants, eating like elephants. He said, this is a mystery. <laughs> this is an abomination. I want you to pray right now. Don't keep quiet. They are using you. You are the one being used. Yet, when they finish, they won't pay you. They'll be telling you stories. In fact, they'll give you a peanut. And you don't even see the money. Open your mouth. Stop agreeing. Yes. Don't say it is the will of God. That's a lie. It's not the will of God. Yes. Yes, tell them I say it's not the will of God. That me say it's not the will of God. The will of God is that you ride on horses. Let the servants walk on the leg. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes. Let things be in order. Yes. Let things be in order. When things begin to run in order, those who are supposed to walk on leg will walk. And those who are supposed to ride horses will ride on horses. They will not be switching. In the name of Jesus Christ, Amen. open your mouth. Every spiritual switch, anger, bonogo, ragi diaka, bante okoro, zapele kebolo, yira bobo, I neutralize every sacrifice I have made against you, against your children, against your, children, against your family. In the name of Jesus Christ, every sacrifice made to high places in order for you to become a servant forever and they will ride on horses ride on your horses I cannot 
sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Oh, sing hallelujah, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. Oh, sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Oh, sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Oh, sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I say, sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. 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 Oh, sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Oh, sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Oh, sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. One more time, sing hallelujah, praise the Lord Jesus. Sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Oh, sing hallelujah, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I want you to lift up your voice wherever you are. Begin to worship the King of Kings. Okay. Yes, say, Mary, my confused, the pronoun of Salaba. Zag seba on fena bonte le cabas. Rabba de ken frumo se blariga. Rabba de can call zemnariba cosa. Jeke jeke mahariba bos. Brabe confabula bose. Rabba de kigabos on telegabros. Rale gadus, rale gadus. Rale gadus me viantos and palibo cassa. In the name of Jesus Christ. Lastly, we're going to pray, but I want us to read the scripture. The Bible says in 2 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 3 to 8, it says, Praise be to the God, hallelujah, and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of compassion, and the God of all comfort, who comforts us in all our troubles, hallelujah. So that we can comfort those in any trouble with the comfort we ourselves.